Hey, Colin. Huh? Tell us about the TV show we're about to make. Well? The Extreme Leftover Challenge. I was sitting here in front of the fridge and my brain started to bubble with ideas. And I said, look at this half and half. And look at this. What could we make with this? Almost anything. Could we eat for free for two whole weeks? I don't know. Come watch, find out. Everything here has meat in it. That does leave us at a huge disadvantage. Oh, except, oh, I thought they were cheese sticks. Crunchy, so crunchy fish sticks. <laughs> There's not a lot for me here. I am hungry though. I think you may have to eat nothing but cheese for the next two weeks. One pickle left? I think you may have to eat nothing but cheese and one pickle. Extreme pickle vision. <laughs> oh my god. I'm about to smack our singer with a pickle. It's so crunchy. This is awesome. Night one. We should document our weight. Today, at the end of the sesh, Shin. Tom, how have you uh, helped out with the Extreme Leftover Challenge so far? So far, I've done the uh, the sun chips and the baked Southwest Ranch Lays. Mmm. Here, have some. Mm. Justin, how do you greet the news of the Extreme Leftover Challenge? I'm excited about it. <laughs> I think. I don't know. Look at this. What's your prediction? Will the team succeed? Um... Doubtfully. Two weeks. Nothing but leftovers. Left by another band. Eggnog. Eggnog. This increases the chances. Syrup. <laughs> Mustard. It's all here. <laughs> Super chunk. Pretzel. Well, yogurt bag. This is a valuable find in here. Mmm. Maybe. Early man. Scavenges. <laughs> the landscape. Mmm. I don't know about this. I'm afraid. Filthy. Tell us about what you're looking for, Dan. Dude, I'm looking for anything edible. There's a lot of shit in here. But I gotta tell you, it doesn't strike me as edible. Colin and I decided we're gonna make a reality television show. Out of this? Yeah. Great. It's called the Extreme Leftover Challenge. <laughs> we're gonna wow. Try. Holy cow. Wow. Dan just struck leftover gold. Pasta. And? A little Parmesan cheese. Oh, man. Nice. Meatloaf <laughs> meal. <laughs> Marks. Yeah, wave marks. Chipotle chili flavor concentrate. It doesn't appear to be any chipotles in it. Uh, some of this. Oh, look. Weiler's beef granules. Makes 30 cups. <laughs> oh, Jesus. We'll definitely be using that. Maggie seasoning. Oh, yar. Seaweed's gone. That doesn't look edible, does it? Dude, an extreme <laughs> leftover challenge. <laughs> Everything that all must be edible. I guess this looks like this is what we'll be using. This will be our kitchen. Is the kitchen a metaphor for our kitchen? Yes. We have to familiarize ourselves with this place. They're massive radioactive mini weeds. Nice. That's the green beans. Raymond? Oh, Jesus. <laughs> extreme leftover challenge just got way easier. Extreme Raymond, damn. We gonna make it? I think we'll make it. It'll be a little difficult. I don't have any, uh, there's no olive oil. This was the first bad, uh, the first bad move of the extreme leftover challenge. First failure. How do you feel? I'm gonna try the rest of it. I feel a little disheartened. Did you ask him how he feels? <laughs> this looks like a treasure. Amidst the rubble. I found this in a trove of juice. I brought my lunch today. Ah, oh, thanks team player. I know. I'm participating in the challenge in my own way. What's the date on that puppy? Oh, that's all right. That milk hasn't even been born yet. <laughs> I'm going for a big question mark here. I'm gonna grab a rotten yogurt and attempt to eat it. I'm going raspberry. I'm going raspberry rotten yogurt. Wait, where's the video camera? We'll need it in 20 minutes. Now and in 20 minutes. Yeah. That'll be the, the fun part of being 29. Let's see what this looks like. Oh. Do you know how long this has been around? No. No idea. It smells good. It's looking good, Dan. Glad to hear it. Dan, our project is uh, really taking off. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got started nice here. Was that a third song? Oh, I was talking about our extreme leftover challenge. Oh, that. I'm not worried about the album. That's gonna be awesome. Pull these out and marinate them overnight. 
Oh, and then we'll, 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 save the, we'll save the chicken bones and roast them in the oven, make chicken stock, and then we can make our own soup. We can put whatever we want into it. Extreme! Oh. <laughs> Extreme! I'll put most of like down here. Complete meals, chicken and biscuits. Complete meals! <laughs> <laughs> Extreme meals completion! No way. This is, this is the grossest thing I've ever seen. Look at this. Extreme goober camp. Goober camp. <laughs> but don't you wonder like how they get them in there? Separate? Good progress. Mm. Yeah, oh, yeah. You're playing progresso rock. When I like to choose progression for. <laughs> <laughs> when I like to make progress, I choose progresso. Look at my progress. His progressions are improving already. <sighs> how come you weren't documenting your part in the leftover extreme challenge time? I found this up here. Like that. Even the bush light cannot escape the wrath of the extreme leftover challenge. Oh, look at this cheese. It was not meant to be blue cheese, but it's blue. Beef franks, these are probably, um... Oh, God. Do we have to eat rotten stuff? I forget if that was a part of the rule. No, we don't have to. We have to try and eat it. <laughs> like the banana, if it's so... This is rotten, I tried this earlier. We don't have to eat stuff that would actually cause us physical harm. But we do have to try to cause ourselves physical harm with that stuff. I don't know what we'll do with this, but we can't. We gotta keep it. You're gonna use the, uh... You want me to find any other? Is there anything else you're lacking? For instance, what's this? You have to find out Mystery, <laughs> Mystery foil, Tom. Really? Reveal this for the listeners at what home. What do we have behind the Foil mystery? number seven. Oh no. What is it? Oh, oh more beef oh, franks. Beef franks. <laughs> if anybody needs the beef franks, they're in the beef frank and uh, Hidden Valley Ranch packet drawer. Okay, we have a single egg. It's a egg. Try a egg. Try, try a, a egg. egg. Okay, let's put that in the new rotten meat drawer. The beef frank drawer. Look, another single egg <laughs> in a four-egged holder. That's the same egg I just put back in there. Oh. <laughs> Why'd you sneak that back in there? There's the egg. That was really weird to me. <laughs> You can't imagine how strange that felt. I bet it's a really big beef frank. I bet it's a huge beef frank. Tell them what they won, Colin. I have no idea. It's wrapping oh, within oh, another it's wrapping. Bacon. It's a bacon frank. Put it in the rotten meat drawer. Chicken oh. breast. Okay, well that could be okay. We never know. We have to give it the benefit of the doubt. Cheese, that will go in the rotten cheese drawer. Was there cheese sitting out here that we should put away? Somebody ate that already. Well, that's good. Progress. The search is starting to yield serious results. Um, this oh, that's is good. It's pepper turkey. Pepper turkey. It's still, it's Someone around here love cheese and beef frank sandwiches on white bread. That's empty. We're allowed to throw that away. Fruit. That's good. Hmm. Sauce. What do you think? What kind of sauce is that? Looks pretty good. These look relatively not rotten. Oh, uh, guess who gets a Pillsbury cinnamon roll? Oh. Okay, this could be a bottle of piss. <laughs> we probably should throw this away. <laughs> what do you think? Yeah. This, carrots and celery, they've got things on us that will kill us. Throw them away. More urine in there too, More. I think. Prego, that's gonna come in handy. This is exhausting. This is leftover challenge, right? Dude, it's the extreme leftover challenge. Premier acai blend. What? There's a lot of useful stuff in here. Diet Snapple, that's not useful for anyone, but it's not gonna kill us, so we can't throw it out. That's got some strange sediment in it. Dude, we have Tabasco for good tastes. That looks real bad. That looks okay. We'll try it at least later. A lot of leftover salad bags. Sparkling vanilla and W. Oh, this is my favorite so far. College Inn Chicken Broth. Oh. Is that a brand name that people trust? Oh, oh College Inn. Oh, good. We have the best chicken broth of my life at college. Unveiling, Tom? Well, what we have in here, as you can see. What's food. behind styrofoam number yeah. one? Yeah! We're going to have, like, have as much food as we thought we did. Yeah, I don't know if we should have instituted this, uh... You're allowed to toss away things that could conceivably kill you, Rule. You have to have fun, not to necessarily die. We've got some silken tofu. Hmm, we've also got some less silken tofu. we got some rotten in the corner tofu. 
It has an X on the top. Somebody wrote on it. Ugh. What if meat was one of us? Look, a pineapple upside down rotten pudding kick. <laughs> I'll eat this for money. <laughs> Smell it. Oh, God, it's not pudding. Oh, it's, some, it's some type of dressing. It's not pudding. It's human no. liver pudding legs. <laughs> we're throwing away all the stuff that seems dangerous, but we're, gonna, we're keeping everything else. I wouldn't trust the tartar sauce. No, nah, that's fine. Somebody around here loved American cheese singles. I ate We've like already five consolidated pieces. 18 packs in here. We got one level left. These apples look good. Eggnog. More syrup. Good. Unexplored territory. Double fridge. shot espresso and cream. Holy shit, Colin. <laughs> this is what the digging's been all about for you, dude. Oh, shit. May I present you with this? Yes, yes, you may. Dude, you want to open and smell? See if it's salvageable? The feta cheese? Yeah. yeah. I mean, it could be worth it. Maybe. I mean, it's like according to the rules, we have to open and smell it. Yeah, it's fine. How could you even buy this many meat packets? I mean, they're all like the same thing. It seems like they're all from the same person. Oh my god. Yeah, it doesn't smell bad. What, what is it? I don't know. What I don't know what it is. It just doesn't smell terrible. Well, then we gotta keep it. Oh. Some kind of meat? No, dude, you cannot eat that. Is it gonna cause us physical harm? <laughs> That's the only yeah. grounds for throwing something oh out. Oh my god. Okay. You cannot. Alright, well, now we know what we have to work with here. We present to you the winner. Colin Kellogg, so far. Winner of the challenge. You have succeeded famously. Day three. Day two. Day two. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> the extreme leftover challenge is beautiful plate of food with a big thumbs up. You got chicken, marinating all kinds of delicious stuff. You have rice and mushrooms, bread, salad. Mm. Wow. Well played, sir. Extreme leftover cereal in the dark. Day four. It's getting creepy in here. Dude, I have bad news. What? Well, I tried to incorporate the eggnog into the extreme leftover challenge. Kind of curdled on me. Oh, man. Curdle nog. Pour it down there for our, for our skunk friend. Look at those chunks. <laughs> We have a skunk friend? We have a skunk friend. Oh, yeah, he hangs out here on the porch at night. Put it right over here. Best of drink for the skunk friend. Best of holiday skunk. Here it goes. It's been fun, curdled eggnog. Why don't we pour it out first before we put it in the nog? That's a good idea. Go ahead, producer man. Pour out that nog. Let's do it. That's not a very good tone. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. You guys have been Drinking oh. this? Oh. Well, not in excess. Day Take seven, extreme, <laughs> extreme leftover challenge. I'm scraping the burnt meat off this tray so I can put my tots on there and inject them with ricotta cheese. <laughs> it's real. Leftover pasta. Day seven. I found this old napkin. That has uh, turkey awesome. in it. No. Yeah. This is not the original one. Dan got this one. That's from the me. new one? It's the new one. The extreme leftover challenge continues. Oh my god. It just got so extreme.